going on Clash Bishers? Rocky here today. We're going to do a war recap. Mad Ram, we had a very close war here. You can see 43 to 43. I'm not going to tell you who wins right now. We will go over that here shortly. Uh, so let's go ahead and get in some of these replays. Let's check out some of these war events. Let's check it out, guys. All right, first we're going to check out Ram. He did a go wipe attack on number three. He was our number three attacker. He got a three star against this base. Pretty awesome attack. Ram is our go wipe expert. Uh, he's just a beast with it. I wish I could go wipe with like him, but I'm working on it guys. I'm working on it I've actually been using go wee wee a lot, but I mean look at that golem in there. Oh my god That's my golem. I donated to him. It looks beautiful nice and purple max golem going to town He's got his golems. He's dropping his peccas. He created a nice funnel in there Ram is really good at just taking out the clan castle troops with wizards uh, He doesn't even lure the clan castle troops when he go wipes most of the time he just goes right in for the base and just goes for the kill, and it's awesome. I'm really jealous because I just can't do it as good as he does. He's awesome with it, man. All right, so we he's getting to the core there. The P.E.K.K.A.'s right up in there to the core. Uh, he's got the Max Golem right in the core with him. It's awesome. Uh, Queen's in there, some wizards. So this Town Hall is going to go down fast. There it is. Town Hall drops already at the two-star, so let's keep going, Ram. Get it. Uh, Pekka's are going down because there's kind of four Teslas punching them in the face. Uh, Wizard's taking out one Tesla. Get it, get it, Wizards. Go, go, go. Uh, still two, three Teslas up. Uh, Pekka on the outside over here with some Wizards hanging out. You know, we got the Golems over here. I believe there's two Golems. Yeah, two Golems over here. Queen's working. Look at those Golems tanking for the Queen. The Queen is just doing work right now. And the Golems are just, has, it just has all the defenses on it. Go, Golems, go. Queen is doing work right now, right behind you, helping you out with the cleanup. King is right there with her. Look, the Queen and King are just safe, guys. Just hanging out while everything else takes the flag. King's going fine. There goes the Archer Tower down. Uh, last Tesla going down right now. He's at 98%. Definitely going to get this 3-star. Look at all these troops. He hits the King's ability just for the hell of it. Great attack, Ram. 3-star on that base. Awesome. Let's check out another replay, guys. All right, this is my boy Neil. Neil is our number four going against their number four. He's got mass drags with zap quake. Uh, he's got a haste and a rage. Uh, gonna be a three star attack, but let's check this out. Uh, he zaps right over here. So I'm assuming he's gonna go in up here. Yep, he starts the drags up here. Go, Neil, go drop those dragons. Get that funnel going. Hopefully, he gets a great funnel in here. I'm assuming he's going to. Um, we usually take Max Loons with our uh, dragon attacks, but I don't know what he has in his clan castle here, so let's check it out. Uh, dragons are doing work. There it is. There's the Max Loons. Great timing on the Max Loons. Great timing on the haste. The haste is just going to push those Loons. There they go. The Loons are just rushing. Go, Loons, go! Uh, great placement on the spell. Great placement on those Loons. Good job, Neil, on that. Uh, the clan castle dragon is out. He rages up all his dragons. Very good decision there. Uh, he's got a dragon on the air defense on the right, and dragons already took out the air defense on the left. All the air defenses are down. He's got four, five, six, seven, seven dragons, eight, nine. He's got almost all his dragons left still. Wow, that's uh, that's pretty amazing for taking out the air defenses and the clan castle dragon. Usually you're down to maybe five or six dragons, but there goes the air sweeper, so no more push. And once these uh, archer towers go down, this base is wrecked. So the Oops, I did not mean to do that. So it turns out to be a three-star, guys. Sorry to cut you short, Neil. I did not mean to do that. All right, Neil got a three-star on number four, or on number five also. Neil is our number four guy. Let's check out Connor's army with the three-star on number six. Let's check this out, guys. He's using Max Dragons with Zapquake. That's a very popular Town Hall 8 attack with us. I really need to teach these guys how to go ho or something else. But uh, Max Dragons worked out for us in this war. So he's going to zap right there. Uh, let's see where he's going in at. There we go. King's down. Where's some dragons out? Oh, he wants to lure the clan castle out. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. He's bringing the clan castle out. Uh, he's got a loon and a dragon in there. He drops four dragons right there. Very interesting, but I'm assuming he just wants to take the, that stuff out. Get a deal. Yeah, it's done. Done in a hurry. That's what we like to see. So the dragons kind of went outside. So that's not always great. There we go. They're going back inside. All right. So he's going to kind of work in from this bottom side of this base. Dropping a few dragons at a time here. Get it, get it, get it, go. There's another dragon down. All the dragons are in. Go, go, go. All right. The air sweeper is pushing. The air defenses are going. He drops the rage. Oh, no. There's some air skellies. No, Larry. All right. He gets in there. Oh, that dragon died. 
Get in there. Come on, guys. Go, go, go. There goes the Max Loons. Hopefully the Max Loons can make a push towards those air defenses. All right, one air defense is going to go down right now. There we go. One air defense is down. The dragons are working. Dragons are working towards that town hall. Ooh, great haste placement. So I like that haste placement right there, guys. He got the haste down. Going on the town hall. Get it, get it, get it. Once you get the air defenses down, as long as you have some dragons left, a good amount of troops left, you're going to usually get a three-star. He's got a dragon over here on the outside. He's got loons still doing work. That's crazy. Loons usually go down a lot faster. Uh, so the loons, he's still got two loons up. Uh, four or five dragons still alive. So really, once he gets rid of the uh, archer towers and Tesla, he should be safe. Uh, last air sweep, or the air sweeper's going down right now. There it is. Dragon got the air sweeper. He's got two dragons about to work on this art or this wizard tower. Uh, go get that archer tower. There we go. There we go. Archer tower is going down. Three, two, one. Get it. Archer tower is down. He's got one dragon there. He's got one dragon up here. And one dragon down here. So this is actually going to be a very close attack as far as time. I'm going to speed it up a little bit because it's going to be a lot of cleanup for a few. So he's got that dragon working up there. He's got the dragon working down here. So just a little bit of time, effort, get in there. Uh, they're just taking down the buildings, standard stuff. Oh no, this dragon's under fire. Dragon, you better hurry up. Alright, he's going for the wizard tower. Get that wizard tower, get it, get it, get it. Wizard tower's down. Get the Tesla, get the Tesla. Tesla's down. Get the archer tower. Oh, he died. Archer's firing on, oh no, the archer tower's firing on the last dragon, guys. Get it, get it, come on, come on, come on, come on. Dragon, get your ass in there. Get your ass in there. That would have been terrible if he would have got the one, or the two star on a 99%. But the dragon comes over and saves the day with the three-star attack. Great attack, Connor. Uh, another three-star raid there. So let's check out some other attacks here. Uh, I'm not going to show you my attack. It's another mass dragon attack. All right, guys. Here we go. This is another mass dragon attack. We use a ton of mass drags. Uh, but this one's a little bit different. He's going to use two healing and one rage. I thought that was very interesting. So he's starting off here. This is my boy Misa with his little account, little Misa. He's our lowest guy. He's attacking number 13. Uh, he's actually going up against Town Hall 8, so this is actually an amazing attack for level 2 dragons with no zap quick just to go wreck this base. So let's go check this out. He's got most of his dragons and he's still holding 4. There they go. The last 4 are down. Uh, he drops his clan class castle loons. He's going to heal. Look at that huge group he's got in that heal there. There's probably 6 dragons in there. That was awesome. Great rage placement there. Uh, he's going to get everyone in that rage awesome he got a huge cluster of dragons a huge cluster of loons very nice rage placement right there me so he drops the other heal trying to keep those loons alive which is very smart by him he takes out that last air defense and it's easy selling from there look he's got let's see three four dragons up there five six seven dragons still alive plus some loons still going to town guys no wonder he got the three star that was very amazing play uh spell placement i've actually never really seen someone use two heals in one rage but it worked out really well for him on this base i'm very impressed little misa i did not watch this attack before this great attack bro keep it up misa supports the streams he donated 15 dollars so we could do a 15 dollars itunes giveaway he gave someone a 10 dollars google play card so shout out to misa my man getting the three star coming through in the war all right, let's clean this up here. Tons of dragons still alive. That's amazing how many dragons are still alive. He had that huge cluster that he healed and raged. That worked out amazing. Good job, Mies, with the great three-star, bro. All right, guys. This this was at the end of the war. The war score was 43 to 43. We were tied. My base only had one star on it. And they're going for a two-star here. They're using mass dragons. So I really... Uh, let's see how this goes. This was right at the end of the war. So if they get higher percentage or even get one star we're screwed we lose the war because i'm yeah at this point we used all of our attacks so this was really for the win they could have won the war right here this is supposed to be an anti two-star base so let's see how it holds up it's a very interesting base i've been enjoying using it i got you know i've got tons of upgraded defenses so it's been working out really well i've been working on my town hall nine so he zaps the uh, ad right there and he's going to fall into my trap. You'll see here, right next to the air sweepers, I have two seeking air mines. So I'm going to mess his dragons up. So let's keep on watching here. He's kind of working his way in. I'm not sure why he went in on that side. Usually, if you need percentage points, I would think he would go in on the other side, right? All right, so the base is kind of covered. It kind of covers itself with the air defenses. So all of his drags are down. 
He's got his loons down over here. He's kind of really spread out here. He's brought a freeze spell. I'm kind of nervous about that freeze spell, but his clan castle loons are, are going down. Oh, he brought some loons too. The loons are down. The drags are making their way into the center. That's not good. That is not good at all, guys. They're getting fired on by the expo and the queen. Get them, queen. Get those dragons, please. All right, one dragon down. Come on, queen. Get them. Queen's down. Oh, no. Oh, no. They might get the town hall. All right, town hall is safe. So let's see. He's got... He's dropping his heroes there. He might get the town hall. And he's got two dragons here and the heroes up there. So let's see how this develops. Um, 23 seconds left on the raid. Let's get it. Come on, base. Show us that defense base. There's the clan castle, a lava hound. Gonna go mess with the king. Come on. Get him, puppy. Get him, lava hound. Lava hound's gonna go move on to the queen. There he goes. He's going to the queen now. The expo's down. We the air defense killed the dragons. The queen is down 44%. We defended, guys. We defended at the end of the war. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So they didn't get very much more percentage points because they didn't even get a star. So I'm going to reveal here this final score of the war. Who actually won this 43 to 43 tied based on destruction points. The winner was... Mad Ram! 98.93 to 97.67. Good job, guys. Way to bring it home. Great attacks, guys. I had, I didn't show it off, but I had a, a 98% uh, go wee wee attack. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna watch it kind of fast. I want, I want to relive my glory here. And this was my first time actually really using a go wee wee in war. So I break down the walls there. I'm gonna kind of make a tank line there, put some witchers behind them. I kind of messed up and put some stuff up top here, not behind the tank line. That kind of affected me, but everything's behind the tank line. We got tons of heals, tons of rages going down. Got one more rage I'm holding on to. Everything's just going to town, guys. Already at the 36%, 39%. Working towards that one star. Already going to get it in a second here. I thought it went faster than that. My bad, my bad, my bad. All right, there goes the one star right about now. There we go. One star is happening. I still got my queen held on to. So we got golems still over here. We got the witches and wizards. We're going to throw the queen in there. She's going to take out this uh, cannon here. She's going to go kill the town hall. So she's going to get us that two star. Go queen, go, 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 go. Queen's going to take out this Tesla. Nice. Queen still got tons of health helping that golem out. Now what the problem was, this golem and Larry's got stuck on this wall for like an hour and a half it seemed. So queen's over here. She's down now. But we got these guys kind of working on the rest of the stuff. We got two witches. And was it about four wizards and they're just kind of working on stuff so the larry's are going to help out and as they work through now the problem was right there let's talk about it right here the witch the wizards went inside that's the problem you'll see what why it's the problem so they're working through this stuff if the wizards would have stayed outside they would have been able to stay back a little bit longer because they would have been working on the buildings so the wizards went inside they kind of screwed over the raid the witches are going to go down right there here comes those Larrys and the little lava, or the golem pups. Ah, uh, rough guys. I'm kind of pissed about it. Ran out of time. If the wizards would have stayed outside, I would have got the three star. Very good attack. So congrats to us, Mad Ram, with the, the very nice 43 to 43 tie victory. Let's check that out one more time. Good job, guys. 150 more experience. Let's keep up the great work. As always, guys, thanks for watching the video. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, keep on subscribing to the channel guys. We're growing really fast. Thanks for clash bashing with me today. Keep on watching guys. Thanks